If you're one person who goes to the bathroom and you don't use water, you only use tissue, I got news for you, baby girl. I got news for you. You stank. You stank. I'm sorry. I just had to say it. You stank. Are you Welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those who are new, my name is Lisa. I do story times, I do girl talks. Speaking of girl talks, I think this is going to be my very first girl talk, like the very, very first one. And I hope you guys enjoy it. And in addition, I do vlogs as well. So if those are things that excite you, don't hesitate to hit the subscribe button and join the family. Join the family, join the gang it's a family here also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up because i'm pretty sure once you see this video you're gonna want to see more of Lisa. period anyways let's not waste time let's get right into this video let's go so the very first tip use water and wipes wet wipes each time you use the bathroom ladies ladies hear me out i don't care how much you trust your tissue trust me when you go to the bathroom and you don't use water or you don't use wet wipes you're not clean you're nasty you're nasty and chances are you stank i'm sorry i'm sorry i had to be the one to tell you i had to be the one to break the news to you baby you don't want to be moving around with a stinky ass you don't want to be moving around tanking you gotta use water let us learn to use water each time we visit the bathroom trust me guys i always tell my friends like i remember one day we were debating about this issue with my friends and you know i was telling them it doesn't matter where you are you always have to make sure you use water each time you visit the bathroom and they were telling me no me i wipe well and i was like guys hmm? take a scenario you drop something on your like on your hand let me say a piece of meat right you drop a piece of meat on your hand and your like your your hand is dirty from all the meat sauce and everything and you just get a, a like a tissue and you wipe away the the what the the sauce right you find that your arm will look clean but when you smell it it will stank right i know i know it's disgusting i know what you're thinking but yeah the same applies to your you know your bottom area it doesn't matter how much you use tissue how much tissue you use you you always have to accompany it with water ladies you always have to be fresh 24 7 always use water i don't care if you're going to do number one or number two you always have to use water regardless especially when you're going to do number two and if you're one person who goes to the bathroom and you don't use water you only use tissue i got news for you baby girl i got news for you you stank you stank i'm sorry i just had to say it you stank so going on to number two mind what you eat ladies there is no way you're going to smell and taste delicious there is no way you're going to smell and taste fresh when the things you eat are nasty avoid eating things that have a very strong smell like things that don't smell you know fresh me personally i'm one person who doesn't like eating fish i'm sorry for my fish lovers i actually love fish but i don't overdo it because I noticed that each time I eat fish, like my, you know, when you use the bathroom, when I go to use the bathroom, like my, my urine will always have that fishy, fishy smell. So, and if, trust me, if the urine is fishy, then how about down there? Eat things that are fresh. I recommend eating fresh stuff, like anything you eat and you feel it smells good, like it tastes good. Trust me, that's how you're going to smell and taste down there so i recommend that you eat things like you know berries things like pineapples heavy on the pineapples heavy on the pineapples me and pineapples best friends we, it's like we it's like we made an oath we are like this inseparable going on to number three 
change your weight clothes and undies there, there is no reason why you should keep on weight clothes there is no reason why you should keep on your weight undies or is change your weight stuff change the weight clothes change the weight undies you know weight stuff weight undies can actually lead to infections and we all want our coaches to you know stay healthy healthy and happy and fresh all day long and speaking of undies always always make sure you wear cotton undies i really don't understand ladies that wear the silk undies you know those things are not good for your ph like cotton is the only recommended material for our coaches for our, I, i'm sorry i feel i'm being so straightforward but i have to like i recommend that you always always buy cotton undies i don't care how sexy those silk and this may look don't get tempted ladies we need to keep our ph on point avoid wearing undies that ain't cotton that's it and that's that period and this brings me to number three is it number three or number four avoid sleeping with tight undies on actually i personally i don't sleep with any undies on <laughs> i don't sleep with any and it's like at times you just have to let your coochie breathe like you just have to let your vagina breathe it's not that all the time you have to keep it in you know undies and you know tight clothes guys let the thing breathe let the coochie breathe huh let her breathe i know this may not work for ladies who have like a heavy discharge but Still, you can put on undies that ain't so tight, especially at night, so that you know you can just let her, just let Madame breathe, let Madame down there breathe. A big. Going on to number five, is this number five? Waxing or shaving, ladies. You always have to keep it down, short and clean. You know, keep it short and clean. There is no reason why you're growing an entire bush down there. For who, my dear one? Always, always, always shave or wax. And I believe waxing is better. Though I personally, I haven't gone for a Brazilian wax before, but I am planning. Actually, I have a scheduled program for you know going for my Brazilian wax. I don't know if I'll record that. Probably I'll most probably or maybe not but i wanna try out waxing because i've heard that it's actually better than shaving because there are no ingrown hairs and you know no one wants that you know a hala of ingrown hairs that comes along with the shaving so you know your girl might take up some waxing i might opt for waxing you never know number six i know this may sound a bit crochet everyone has told you this and you're like oh good i'm tired of hearing that but water take water you should always take water i don't care how many times you have had this it is the truth trust me guys water is the truth you have to always take water and stay hydrated it will help you down there like it will keep you fresh moist you know you will just feel good and smell good of course always always take water i don't understand ladies that say they don't take water like girl girl i feel bad for your man i feel bad for your man trust me ladies water is it water is the secret water 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 i don't care how many times you've had this stick to it it is the truth so i'll end with this i know this may not have to do with the coochie but it's also very very much important oral hygiene ladies oral hygiene i don't know about you guys but get turn off is someone with bad breath i i just can't stand you i'm someone who has a bad breath halitosis like why don't you brush your teeth and your tongue your tongue especially like i don't understand people who say i can't brush my tongue because you know when i brush my tongue i feel like you know throwing up then throw up i mean throw up if that's what you have to do throw up but clean your tongue clean your teeth clean your tongue trust me there is no one who wants to you know kiss someone with a dirty mouth kiss someone with bad breath you shouldn't have to put your partner through that that misery like ladies at least let's take care of our you know oral hygiene our teeth our tongues like 
let's just keep it clean and cute right guys that brings us to the end of this girl talk i hope you enjoyed this video share it with your mama share it with your papa share it with your loved ones share it with whoever you think might find this informative and interesting and always come back for more i love you guys till next time peace and love bye